is on Tennessee now. Uh, we've already, you know, yesterday installed and started game planning and had a good good practice and uh, looking forward to the practice today. How challenging for you personally will it be against Dobbs with his running ability? Yeah, I mean, anytime you have a running quarterback, it it makes everything a little tougher, you know, because you have to respect him in that aspect because. Even in passes, you gotta you know be aware of where he's at and if he's outside the pocket or not. So we just gotta do a great job of trying to keep him contained and just you know focusing you know locking down on him. A lot of people don't realize you're an ex teammate of Dobbs. Yeah. And you were like what six seven years old. What yep. was the story behind that? We just we play, I grew up in Alpharetta with him. Uh -huh. um, uh, really opposite sides of Alpharetta, but we both played park ball together, uh -huh. um, AYFA, and we played together for a few years. My dad was our coach. So I uh, ran into him as we grew up. You know, when we stopped playing park ball, you get into middle school and whatnot. You know, we we were different different schools, but I still, you know, kept up with him. Then I moved to Birmingham, mm -hmm. kind of lost touch. But I saw when he signed with Tennessee, mm -hmm. and I've been keeping up with him. So so park ball. How old is that? What age group is that? Probably from you know like when you're five to. 10, probably 12, around there. Could you tell he was an absolute genius then, like he was <laughs> kind of aerospace engineering now? I, I don't think so. I don't, you know, it's tough to remember back that far <laughs> when I was, you know, five or six. Right, I, was, right. I remember we had a good, I remember we had a good team, so uh, I do remember that. What was the last time you talked to him? Uh, I haven't talked to him in a long time, okay. so I can't even remember. What position?